Yo, what is up you guys? My name is Benji and welcome back to another video. Before we get started with this one, make sure to please drop a like in the video for some good luck for AMC. If you guys want some all-time highs very soon like I do, drop a like in the video for some good luck. I'm super excited to announce that we currently have a few more slots open for our exclusive private trading discord. Inside the discord, you'll find real-time stock picks from yours truly, see all my trades in real time, and chat with other thousands of investors that are constantly posting plays, trades, and more. We even have multiple millionaire investors in there, which you could pick their brain, ask them questions, etc. So make sure you guys join before we close the server again, because we are only letting in a limited amount of people. Click the second link down below in my description to join. All right, guys, we have a lot to get through. I'm not going to lie. So let's get right into it. First of all, don't make the mother of all short squeeze mistake. The mother of all short squeeze may or may not be upon us in the near future. And while there's tons of great advice on what to do and what not to do, what it happens. As OG apes know, when market volatility goes haywire, the big bad steps in and halts all trades for a period of five minutes. These periods, for whatever reason, tend to create a lot of panic and ultimately paper handing resulting in an absolutely decimated market price after trading resumes. We've all seen it happen to our brothers and sisters at GME, and it will happen upon us. Now this is a really good point guys, if you've been trading for a while, you're very familiar with halting in the markets. A lot of times when stocks IPO, they do end up halting for five or so minutes, which basically means that trading is temporarily paused for the stock and then once it unhalts, a lot of times the stocks can absolutely rip or a lot of times they can also just sell off like crazy. Apes, I'm here to remind you that when AMC halts on our way to the moon, don't panic. I have your back and trust that you have mine, no matter what number is dangling in front of our faces, before after the halts, I'm holding until we're all disgustingly wealthy so that we can take back our power and establish fair market for all. And next guys, remember a short squeeze is infinite. The longer AMC is held, the higher it goes. Nobody knows how high it will go. Nobody, not mainstream media, not Michael Burry, not Trey, not Lou, not any expert, not Einstein. Apes own the flow, apes control the price. This has never happened before. No one has experienced this type of short squeeze before. Anything is possible, so when people tell you a certain number isn't realistic, how do they know? A short squeeze is infinite. The amount of naked shorts, fake shares, and failure to delivers makes anything possible. People say diamond hands for a reason. The longer apes hold, the higher the stock goes. Apes on the float, apes control AMC, nobody can force you to sell, nobody can tell you what price is impossible. Anything is possible in a short squeeze. If you have done your DD, then you should know that mathematically, $1 million is possible. A million dollar question is, will the apes hold that long? And that's also a very good point. We've talked endlessly by now how AMC could easily, mathematically speaking, hit super, super high amounts of share price. But it's going to take the retail community to still band together like we have been and not sell until it hits a price that we're comfortable with selling. Next, let's talk about the SEC. When the SEC finally has everything in place to allow the mother of all short squeezes, in huge part thanks to the months of rules coming out, people will say, oh look, they actually did something. But what SED is doing is something, and some of you apes are way too dense to see and understand that. Remember this post. The economy would literally crash if we set off the mother of all short squeezes right now. Let's recap some facts. SEC has a new chairman, Gensler, known for seeking justice and fairness in the market. SEC has filed countless new rules to protect retail investors and in black and white prevent more failures to delivers and naked shorts, among other things. SEC hires NJ Attorney General Grewal, who specializes in guess what? Checkers, options, video games, no, enforcing rules, such as white collar crimes and malpractices. Hmm, starting to figure this out, let's keep going. SEC has changed liquidity requirements to be handled within 24 hour periods from previously like 10 plus days or something. I think it was like once a month or twice a month. SEC has required members to increase liquidity on hand to, I think, 250K or something like that. I mean, do I have to keep going on? All of these points to one thing, enforcement. It's progress and it takes time. Now think about it, guys. If AMC three months from now is at 78,000 plus a share, you sold at $400 because you got overexcited, which is understandable because you haven't had any money like that before. Real apes are in the millions now when you pocketed 10K regretting it because you realize you could have been sitting on your mortgage paid off and no bills the i was in the stock market i could have been a millionaire if i hadn't sold and lastly guys enough said if we were wrong they would have had cover by now very very true if we were wrong they wouldn't have hired thousands of shills and written bot scripts for accounts if we were wrong they wouldn't be offering people money to become bots 
If we were wrong, they wouldn't be shutting down YouTube investors and sending cease and desist letters, financial investment brokers to speak out against them. If we were wrong, they wouldn't tell us we were wasting our money. If we were wrong, they wouldn't need to continue to borrow shares to fight us. And finally, if we were wrong, they would have disproven our DD and facts. They have to yet to disprove in it or why the mother of all short squeeze won't happen. Not a single shred. But if you guys want to stay up to date with everything else going on with AMC, because trust me, there's a lot more to sift through. Make sure to please subscribe to my channel with notifications turned on so you never miss out on a video. Also, like this video for some good luck for AMC, guys. I hope we see some green in the market today. As well as if you haven't already, make sure to go down to my description, the second link down there, and join our private exclusive Discord server. But be fast because we are only accepting a few more members. Thanks as always, guys, and I'll see you in the next one.